Hi guys and welcome to Varick Mitsubishi. My name is Jamie and today I'm going to take you for a walk around tour of our 2016 Subaru Impreza 2.0 IS. Very impressive car in that beautiful Subaru blue. Um, we're going to start with the very front here. So at the front you can see here that big uh, Subaru grille, the big Subaru uh, logo. Um, obviously you've got some aggressive headlights here at the front there. Uh, underneath that the fog lights. Um, got a bit of uh, the black um, going through there as well just to break it up. Um, obviously a heap of the silver the chrome garnishing as well which just makes it really stand out look really really aggressive and it's a beautiful style that I think we all know um, a Subaru tend to have come around to the driver's side here um, I can't see anything to really point out on this car it is in absolutely fantastic condition um, oh that's actually dirt so I thought I was going to be able to point something out there for you um, again dirt uh, first uh, standard premium uh, alloy there as you can see, absolutely perfect condition, fantastic tread on the um, on that wheel there. Um, let's keep moving across. Um, over here on the side there, you've got your uh, color-coded mirrors with your inbuilt indicators. Um, keeping on coming across. Again, I still can't see anything on these panels um, to point out for you. I'll try and be as picky as I possibly can. Um, we've got the color-coded uh, door handles with the chrome garnish coming through there as well. Um, so with this car, it does have uh, it does have the proximity keys um, a little bit different with the Subarus of course so you don't need to have um, if you have the key on you um, just slide your finger across to unlock the car close the door slide your finger across to lock up the car which is a really cool feature a little bit different to the other proximity keys with all the other brands keep coming across let's have a look at the second premium alloy wheel there again I just can't seem to spot anything to point out to you and um, doesn't seem to be any kind of gutter rash at all fantastic tread on the wheels there uh, let's keep coming across obviously your fuel cap there um, okay coming through to the back there as you can see big tail lights um, big red tail lights um, for safety uh, as we know Subaru is very well known for their safety um, still again can't see anything on this back bumper here can't see anything on the hood um, let's open up the boot there large boot space um, as you can see there um, clearly got some uh, Subaru mats in there for you as well um, keep on coming across again I just can't see anything there um, let's come around to the passenger side um, passenger side back wheel there um, this is usually where you would see um, you know gutter rashes and things like that these Dunlop tyres look almost brand new um, can't see any damage on that alloy at all so let's keep coming across just having a look through the car let's try and be as picky as we can it's literally just dirt everything is rubbing off as I run my fingers through it um, this car is actually in unbelievable condition it is a 2016 it's only done about 22,000 kilometers um, coming around to the passenger front wheel this is the first bit of anything I don't even know if the camera can pick that up it's the slightest slightest bit of uh, gutter rash there that if I wasn't looking I honestly would not have even been able to see so looking all around there um, as you can see this uh, Impreza is very impressive I really can't fault it aside from that slight bit of rash on the um, on the passenger side obviously also um, fitted with a sunroof there if that camera can uh, have a look up there fantastic condition really haven't got anything to fault it with uh, so what we'll do now is we'll pop the hood open um, have a bit of a chat about what's under the bonnet and uh, then we'll go inside and have a bit of a look inside the car as well having a look under the bonnet guys please pay attention to how well kept this engine bay has been this is a four cylinder um, 2.0 litre uh, engine so it produces about 110 kilowatts of power about 196 newton meters of torque it is a six speed uh, constantly variable transmission obviously being subaru it is an all-wheel drive um, on average it's actually quite economical 6.8 liters per 100 uh, kilometers giving you about 
55 litres to a tank, which is equivalent to about 809 kilometres um, to a tank, which is obviously absolutely fantastic. Uh, also has a five-star ANCAP rating, as you'd expect, and seven airbags um, as a standard as well. All right, guys, sitting inside the Impreza, again, I really, just having a look around the car and sitting in it, it feels really comfortable. Um, beautiful ivory leather, um, just looks really, really slick, really clean. Um, but look, we're gonna run through some of the features um, around the inside here as well. Um, but I do want you to pay attention to just how how well maintained this car is. Obviously, only done about 22,000 kilometers. It has been maintained very well, but let's start off here over to the side as I said we do have that ivory leather um, trim um, on the sides we do have our power mirrors obviously your um, your door handles there which are chrome um, your mirror adjustments there beautiful um, beautiful garnish across here too just really breaks it up against that black and that um, that cream leather um, over here this is obviously a push button start um, engine so um, over here we do have our traction control, obviously headlight um, adjustments there. Um, coming across more to the middle, you do have your um, your racing um, style um, screen here. We do have um, here over here on our leather leather uh, wrap steering wheel. Um, we do have our audio controls. Um, sorry, we do have our um, cruise controls. Uh, over to the left here, we do have all our audio controls there. Um, we've got some paddle shifters in the back there. Turning over to the right, we do have our indicators and headlights um, over here. Turning it over to the left there, um, you do have your um, windscreen wipers etc. Um, coming across over to the middle let's start with the top there um, you see that screen up there which at the moment shows us the time over to the left obviously we do have our um, dual climate control settings um, as we move down this button here got the hazard lights of course um, that will show us our uh, fuel range a really really cool um, really really cool screen there that gives us so much information about how we're driving um, and how we are um, and the econ economy of the car. Uh, moving down a little bit more this car has been fitted of course with the satellite navigation um, just popping the car into reverse you will see that we do have our reverse cameras there obviously showing us where we are going to end up. Um, just pop that back in there Really cool feature I think that um, seems to be lost these days is uh, having a um, having a CD player. <laughs> Dual climate control obviously saves uh, saves the any dramas when someone's hot and someone's cold. Generally happens when um, you know the uh, the men are always uh, seem to be quite warm, but the women always seem to be uh, <laughs> quite cool. So. We're going to have a quick look over at the um, service books here as well. Just such a well-maintained car. It's uh, quite impressive. As I understand the car, having been such well-maintained, uh, it actually will come... Whilst I'm looking at this, our cameraman will just pan around the, um, the car there so you can have a look a little bit more closer at the condition of the car. Um, I'll be surprised actually if there's anything to point out there, but please pay, pay close attention. Um, so the car does actually have with a full, uh, come with a full service history. Um, done its first health check there, done another uh, service at uh, 6,000, 5,909Ks. Um, another one at 18,000 Ks, another one at 22,000 Ks that we did um, just uh, just recently when we brought the car in. Um, so very well maintained, full service history and then another service again which we've done um, as we do with all of our cars because we do need to make sure that they are in absolutely tip top condition as we can provide something called a premium mechanical protection plan that is unique to our dealership. The one thing that I would probably say this car probably lacks a little bit of is a bit of tint. Um, you can see today it's quite a sunny day which is great for um, I guess now spring uh, in Melbourne um, one thing that I do notice is if there was a bit more tint here definitely um, would be uh, fantastic let's keep going over here a little bit um, we do have our 
um, our power socket uh, over here, got the USB and the AUX uh, controls. Over here we do have our um, automatic transmission uh, stick. Um, moving down a little bit more, you've got two cup holders there. You can close that up if you don't want to look at it. Um, we do have, not sure if we can pick this one up, um, but obviously you can try the seat controls, um, the heating, heated seats. Um, over in the middle console there, just the big storage um, center console there. Uh, don't really have much else to really go by. In all, in all series, oh, got some, <laughs> got some, with uh, our sunroof up at the top here, you do have that, um, that uh, open and close um, thing there. We do also have some lights up here, um, and obviously our um, sunroof controls over here as well. Guys, thank you again for um, watching the walk around video of this 2016 Subaru Impreza. Um, this is the 2.0 IS with about 22,000 kilometers. Um, it is absolutely in fantastic condition as you guys saw. Paintwork, absolutely immaculate. Probably the only other thing that I would add to this is uh, the glass coat to maintain that shine. It is an amazing blue color. Um, the other thing I mentioned as well, this um, car does qualify for our pre premium mechanical protection plan which will cover 181 components of this car for five years. You'll get a 10-year Platinum Roadside Assist as well. For a little bit more information, please click the link below. Thank you again for watching the video. Berwick Mitsubishi, 9907 555.